Hello guys and welcome to this Half-Life 1 Reloaded, the HD tutorial. There actually is a HD texture pack available for Half-Life 1. However, we are lucky. In 2012 the Black Mesa project was released. This standalone project is just actually Half-Life 1 and the Half-Life 2 engine. And the good part is, it is free for everyone. That means you don't necessarily need Half-Life or Half-Life 2. The installation of Black Mesa is not that hard. However, some people still have problems with it, so I'll show you how to do it. First of all, go to blackmesasource.com. So go to download and then select a mirror. I select game front, the first mirror. Then there you can scroll down and only download the archive file. If the site don't work, just try another mirror. Then click on download now and wait or click on download directly. Save it somewhere you like. And once the mod finished downloading, you can extract the downloaded archive, the 7-zip file. Notice that it will also take a while. In this extracted folder, there is everything we need. Before we install Black Mesa, we first need the SDK 2007. So go to your Steam, then your library and select tools. In the search field, search for SDK. We are going to need the SDK 2007, so install it and wait for it to be downloaded and installed completely. You can always check out the process in Steam itself. Please note that I always shorten and speed up the download and install times on my video. For you it will probably take a while, don't worry about it. So once it finished downloading, now you have to make sure you completely exit your Steam. Else Black Mesa cannot install properly, so make sure you exit it completely. Once you are finished, go to your Black Mesa setup folder and click on the setup file. Then click on install and make sure you select your Steam folder, so your Steam apps folder. Double check that location. The installation of Black Mesa also is going to take a while, so please be patient. And once Black Mesa finished installing, you get the following screen. Once you click on finish, Steam will automatically st uh, start and will try to lock you in. Sometimes an extra restart of Steam is necessary. It's a little bug known to Black Mesa. At first startup, it will also not automatically detect your settings, so make sure you select all your settings to very high. Also select the widescreen option if you do not see the full HD resolution. Then just start the game and have fun playing Black Mesa, Half-Life 1 in a Half-Life 2 engine. And with that we also came to the end, thanks for watching.